Hey guys, over the last couple of weeks, I've had several people drop me notes asking me about my TomTom -tom and how I've mounted my TomTom -tom to the, uh, the bars on my bike. So I thought I'd do a quick video about it. It's actually pretty easy. I connect my TomTom -tom to my SP Connect Bar Mount Pro, and that's the anti-vibration module there, with uh, this little interface. The TomTom -tom model that I have is the Rider 550. And it comes with pretty much everything you need in the box, but the mounting system that they include is ginormous. It's huge. And if you hung around my channel for any length of time, you know that I probably want something a little more refined and elegant when I mount this on my bike, which is why I decided to go with the uh, SP Connect. This is the TomTom -tom 550. You can see it's a fairly small unit. It's not overly large. If you look on the back, you can see the uh, interface here where the big honk and mount that they provide in the box actually connects, uh, and it provides power through this connector here. I just use the USB port to provide power to the TomTom. -tom. This is the adapter I bought from SP Connect to mount the TomTom -tom to their uh, mounting system. This is called a universal interface. I'll put a link to this from Amazon down below so you can check it out. You see on one side it has 3M tape. Uh, on the other it has the interface for the SP Connect. So you'll notice I haven't taken the 3M uh, tape off or the, the cover from the adhesive off. That's because I haven't had to use it with a TomTom. -tom. You actually look, this is just about the same size. It's kind of a tight fit. This, but you slide this up in there and that will hold on um, by friction. It's not, it's not coming off once you get it on there. Um, and actually to do this video, it took me a lot of effort to try to get it to detach from the TomTom. -tom. But that will stay in place just like that without using the adhesive. And then all you do is mount this to your SP Connect mount, in my case, the Bar Pro mount that I have. And that's it. Nice. Keeps everything down to a small size. I've been running my TomTom -tom like this with that attached this way with friction on the back for a year. Um, I actually got the TomTom -tom 550 because Volts recommended it. That's what he has. He's been running his for two years. He also runs SP Connect, and he has uh, done the same thing with the universal interface. Just slid it into place here and let friction hold it. And that's it, guys. So then when you get back on the bike, you just line that up, turn it, and you're good to go. And of course, I run my power cable up for power. That's it. I've got an Amazon affiliate link to that universal interface in the description below. Check it out. You guys have a good one. Peace.